First here at 6 o'clock, deputies in Sequoia County just arrested four people after a child died in an explosion. The Sequoia County Sheriff says a stove blew up because one of the suspects was playing with explosives. Debris from that stove hit the eight-year-old boy in the head and also injured his stepfather. News on 6 reporter Tony Russell went to Sequoia County just north of Muldrow where federal agents are now investigating. Neighbors tell me they heard a lot of people gathering at this home yesterday, and when they heard the explosion, they saw something in the air. Bill Edwards and his wife were shocked when they heard a loud boom from the neighbors. See it real well uh, up past the treetop. It went away up there. This home north of Muldrow is where the Sequoia County Sheriff says someone loaded two pounds of tannerite, an exploding target, to an old stove on the front lawn and shot at it with a high-powered rifle. Sheriff Ron Lockhart says the stove blew up. And the front door of the stove flew off, hitting and injuring an eight-year-old boy. He later died at the hospital. Michelle Jones says she can't believe what happened. The family's a very good friend of mine, and I'm heartbroken that they had to lose a child. And then they need help, they need support, and I'm back. And 100%. Sheriff's deputies arrested Brandon Martin on complaints of manslaughter. Lockhart says Martin shot at the Tannerite in the stove. It's not an accident. You know, any, any adult should know better than to put children in danger or adults in danger. Deputies arrested Martin's parents and Paul Griffin for obstructing their investigation. Well, it's tragic enough that you know, you've, you've got an eight-year-old that's passed away. But you've got adults now lying to us about what's happened. The sheriff tells me ATF agents are conducting an investigation because the Tannerite was used inside a stove as a bomb. Tony Russell, News on 6.